Hello guys, welcome back to LineUp. For today's video, we are going to show you or discuss with you how to connect hosting your domain to Go High Level. So if you're interested, let's start a tutorial. So in this case, you might be wondering how do you exactly connect your hosting or domain to Go High Level? Well, connecting your hosting or domain to Go High Level is fairly easy. So the first thing that you want to do is you want to go to Go High Level first and you want to go and sign in into your account. But once you've signed in, at the bottom left of your screen, you should be able to see a settings icon there. Go ahead and click on it. And from then on, you want to look for other settings and you want to click on domain. Now, other domain, you should be able to see this section here, which is going to be at the very center. Just go ahead and click on add domain or add at the top right. Now, in here, you want to enter your domain URL. So in this case, enter your domain URL here without the www. But in this case, it is still needed. So if you want to allow that, so go ahead and just uh, enable the, uh, I also want to add www dot on the very first, go ahead and enable that. But once you've done, so just make sure it's just uh, three W's, no, no extra ones here. But once you've done that, you can go ahead and click on add record manually. Now the thing with how go go level uh, go high level here actually works is if you're using a GoDaddy uh, domain, it will reject you to the sign up page. But if you're using other uh, websites or domains out there, like for example Hostinger, well you need to add this uh, uh, you need to add this manually for you. So you know, need to click on the add record manually and at the bottom left here. And from then on, it's going to uh, basically uh, say setting up your domain. But in this case, and the next pop-up, it should give you this pop-up here. Now, what you need to do is you need to add the following values into your domain. So you need to add an A record, a C name record, and you need to also specify the host for it. And also the required values that you need to use for it. Now, obviously, I've blurred the or removed the required value section here because this one is actually um a quite private so in this case you still be you should be able to still be uh able to copy it out by clicking on the copy button but in this case you just need to refer to the following values that you see in here so how do you add those uh records here so again the a record and the c name record as well as the host which is at and ww so let's go ahead and open up hostinger so in here, what we need to do is we want to go to hpanel.hostinger.com. Again, log in into your account and you want to go to the left side here. You want to go to domains and you want to go to domain portfolio and you want to go access your domain. So in this case, I have a domain here. So this is my domain. Let's go ahead and click on it. And in here, you want to go to DNS name servers. Now, what we need to do is, again, we need to add a record for it. So if you do see any C name or A records already existing in here, I recommend you to delete or click on delete here. And once you've done that, you want to go ahead and click on the manage DNS record section. And for example, for the, uh, the type here, you want to choose a record. The name is going to be A. And from then on, you could go ahead and paste whatever you copied for the A record. Now, once you've added all the details, go ahead and click on add record. Now, other, uh, the other thing here is going to be your C name. Go ahead and choose C name. And if I'm not mistaken, this is going to be www. And from here, just paste whatever target you have and just click on add record at the right. Now, by the way, for TTL, you could go ahead and keep this by default unless specified by go high level. But in this case, go ahead and click on add records. Once you've added those two records and define their values, you just need to wait for around like 24 to 40 hours in order for the changes to take effect. But Usually, that should do about it. But in this case, that's about it. Hopefully, this video is able to help you like and subscribe at CLNF. Thank you for watching.